Good morning, APA families. This is your Friday, October 22nd elementary update. Uh, first of all, picture day. Just wanted to remind everybody that picture day had been moved to next Wednesday, October 27th. Uh, the expectation is that cadets will wear their school uniform. And for those of you who would like to order in advance, you can go to mylifetouch.com. Again, that's all one word, mylifetouch.com. Um, and I believe that's the way that the company would like you to purchase those pictures. So if you could do that, we'd much appreciate that. Also, APA Online Cadets, you are invited to um, come for picture day as well. The photographer will be here from 8 to 11.30. So adults and parents of our APA Online Cadets, um, you can bring your student in. They would need to wear a school uniform when they come in for the picture. Um, you would need to stay here at school in the uh, lobby area while they get that picture taken. So just wanted to let you know that as well. Secondly, um, next Thursday, October 28th, is our costume day and uh, cadets can dress up. Um, we're not really calling it a Halloween dress up, but it is a costume day for cadets to uh, dress up, be fun, um, wear what they'd like to. There is no cost to this, and um, the only expectations would be that cadets are not wearing any masks, anything that cover their face, that there are no weapons that are brought to school, and then, of course, that it's um, appropriate if there are certain uh, pictures or words uh, written that it would be appropriate for school. So just heads up on that. Uh, next Friday, October 29th, is an e-learning day. That means cadets will be at home working um, on curriculum that day while teachers and staff are here doing professional development. Um, we have been doing, or the NHS uh, at 29th Street has um, put together a food drive, toiletry drive for Willow Place in the Christian Center. And that drive continues through Thursday, October 28th. Um, it is an opportunity for cadets to get community service hours as well. And just as a reminder, that information was sent home um, through a document um, earlier this week, or actually at the end of last week. Uh, attendance, just as a reminder to you all that if you notify your cadet or your child's teacher that your child is going to be out for a day, uh, going to be absent, we appreciate that. However, just as a reminder, if you do not call the attendance line, the school's attendance line, then it's not counting as an excused absence. So if your child is going to be absent, please call the attendance line 649-8472, option one, to let us know so that we can make sure that we know what's going on and excuse absences so that you're not getting um, letters sent home about um, excessive absenteeism or unexcused absenteeism. Uh, lost and found. We have quite a few items that have made their way to the lost and found. So if your child has been missing a jacket, if they're missing articles of clothing, whatever it might be, you might remind them to come check the lost and found. If you would like to come check the lost and found, you can do that as well because that is in our um, lobby, our, our main entrance. And finally, uh, the Cincy orders, the Cincy fundraiser that Mrs. Hoseman helped put together, those orders have come in and they will be being sent home to you all next week. All right, I believe that's all I have for today. Remember, as always, you can get a hold of me at afraley at goapa.org. That's A-F-R-A-L-E-Y at G-O-A-P-A.org. Or you can call the school at 649-8472 and um, get a hold of me through Miss Tiffany. As always, we appreciate that you've chosen APA. Please feel free to reach out to me for any concerns that you have, any needs that you have. I hope you have a great weekend. Go Jets.